Hey guys, it's Sarah. So, today I am going to be doing a makeup tutorial in which I show you how to achieve this kind of bronzy, rosy, kind of full face makeup. This is something new on my channel, so hopefully you guys enjoy, but I'm just going to take you through all the steps to achieve this look. So first we're going to start with a clean and moisturized face. Start with some baby skin primer and just kind of apply it. Next, we have some Too Faced foundation, Born This Way in shade Vanilla, and I'm just applying it with a Morphe M439 brush. And just make sure to kind of bring it down onto your neck, and don't forget your eyes. Then I'm just kind of patting it in with a Beauty Blender. Then we're going to be contouring with the Anastasia Contour Cream Kit, and I'm going to be using the color Java. So I'm just applying it with the Real Technique Sculpting Brush, and I really want to hollow out those cheekbones. I have a really round face, so contouring is really a necessary step for me. And I'm just kind of bringing it along the bottom of my jaw to, once again, just like really define my face. And then I'm just going to go in and blend it all in, being really careful to not smudge the contour around and move it out of place. And now for concealer, I'm using the Maybelline Dark Circle Eraser in Fair, and I'm just going to be applying that under my eyes, on my eyelids, and just anywhere else that I feel needs to be hidden. And then also just on the bottom of my contour to really make it pop. And then with the Beauty Blender, I'm just going to tap gently on all the concealer that I just applied. Just really working it in. Next, we're going to set all that with some powder. I'm using the Marcel Powder in Translucent and then applying it with the Morphe E3 brush. Then I'm just going to quickly tap some more bronzer into the hollows of my cheekbone to really make it pop. And I'm just using the bronzer in the Naked Flushed palette. Blush time! I'm using Revlon's Wine Not Yas, girl, not looking like a fetus. Eye time, and I'm using the Morphe 350 palette, just using this light white color as my base. Then I'm just gonna go in with this light bronze color and just kind of gently work that in. Then we're gonna be switching the palette to the Too Faced Le Grand Chateau. And then we're gonna be using the color Bonjour. And then on the outer corners, we're gonna be using the dark brown color La Femme. Then we're gonna blend it all together with the Morphe M441. Then back to the Morphe palette, we're going to be bringing some of the brown color onto the lower lash line with the Morphe M432 brush, which is awesome for this. It really is just, does a really tight job. Then I'm just gonna take this really light shimmery color and just gently pat it on top. And then going in with the NYX Wonder Pencil on the lower lash line, on the inner corner and then just right underneath my eyebrow just to kind of brighten up my eye. Okay, I'm sorry, I had to step away to do my eyeliner because I couldn't hold my little mirror and also do the liner, but I used the Sephora Classic Line Eyeliner and just did a really thin line, as you can see here. Woo, liner. And now for the most important part of the face, the eyebrows. I'm using the Anastasia Dip Brow in Taupe and I'm just applying it with a cheap Kirkland eyebrow duo thing. So I'm just really taking my time with this, overlining a tiny bit just because I have very sparse brows. Now we're going to be highlighting with essentially the gift of the gods, Becca's Champagne Pop. This stuff is amazing. It highlights like no other and I'm just kind of applying it all over my face and I would bathe in it if I could. Now for the worst thing ever. <laughs> Why? Oh god. Okay, it's actually worth it though, so just, you know, do it. And then I'm just gonna layer on some L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Carbon Black. And this stuff is really, really good for just like layering on a bunch without looking too cakey. And I always put some on the lower lashes because I just really like the look. Then let it dry and hopefully don't sneeze and ruin it because that always happens. Then I'm lining with the Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner in 063 East End Snob. Then I'm gonna layer some Wet n Wild lipstick on top and this is 902C Bear It All. 
And there, ladies and gentlemen, is the completed look. I'm gonna be leaving the name of all the products and brushes that I used in the description bar below. This was my first makeup tutorial and I had such a fun time making it. So I'm definitely gonna be making more lifestyle videos in the future because I'm just trying to branch out my content. So if anyone has any suggestions or things you wanna see me do, absolutely let me know and I will definitely be open to any and all ideas but yeah so thank you guys so much for watching my video my name is Sarah and I will see you guys later